Good evening, my name is Sergeant Laura Mullick, and my book review was about the book Legacy by James Kerr. This book focuses on a rugby team out of New Zealand called the All Blacks, and this team is having a lot of issues with their own um, interpersonal communication and relationships. They're not really working together. Um, they're not winning games. They're not doing well in practices. They overall have lost their culture, their purpose. Um, a lot of them end up leaving the team and some and they have new people come in. They have different, they have a change of leadership. All of this affects their culture. So basically they go through and they, um, you know, find their culture or find a culture that suits them better. They redo their, um, they make people responsible and accountable for um, their actions and their words. They really do a lot of team building exercises. This is all seen um, the firsthand experience of James Kerr. Um, he's actually watching and observing the team as they go through all of these different changes and um, this um, building up of their culture so that they can be more successful. Um, and it really ends with the team being extremely successful. They're the best, one of the best rugby teams in the world. And they really focus, the book really focuses on a lot of key core concepts, things like purpose, character, um, culture, responsibility, accountability, um, and how all of those things come together to make a better team, but also a better individual. Um, I like this book because this book does what a lot of really inspirational things do for me, and it makes me feel something. It, it, it hits me in the feels, and it makes me feel um, something positive, like I can make a difference, or these are things, these are easy, these are things that I can do within my own life to make not only myself a better leader, but to be a better person overall. And I think that's really important for all of us. Um, this book is really applicable for anybody, regardless of the line of work you want to do or the line of work you're in. Um, I think any everybody would benefit from reading this book just based off of the concepts that it focuses on within the book itself. Um, it's extremely important, in my opinion, and just even from reading the book, um, but to be able to be inspired by something and for that to bring out the goodness in yourself. So like I said, this book, um, I think when things make an impact in your life is when they make you feel something emotionally or you can attach an emotion to something, which is what this book really did for me. Um, it really helped me feel something. And uh, because of that, I was able to personalize the book or maybe and you know, bring aspects of it into my own life, which I think is really positive. Um, like I said, overall, I think um, all the sergeants, sh all sergeants should read it. It's a really good book. Um, and it's something that people can take um, bits and pieces out of and apply to their own life um, because not all of us have a perfect, have a perfect character or we have perfect culture, um, all, you know, or do we, you know, there are many things that we can do to redefine ourselves to make ourselves better. Um, and this book really does that for me. It's very inspirational. It focuses on a lot, of, like I said, the key core concepts. And it even relates a lot of things into the Marine Corps itself. It focuses on the military and how um, certain concepts, like I think BAMTIS was in it and the OODA loop was in it. And it really focuses on those ideas and how the, Marine, the military itself is very successful because it focuses on team building exercises. It has a very rich, especially exclusively with the Marine Corps, it has a very rich culture with traditions that are upheld to the highest esteem. And because of that, it makes that branch of service better than others. Um, because it, again, the Marine Corps, I remember when I first got my EG, my Eagle open anchor, and it made me feel something. It was something that I worked really hard for, and it was something that I could personalize with myself, which is, again, I think extremely important when you want to speak to people or speak to their character. Um, I do think this book can apply to anybody, like I said, um, even those who have good character and have good morals and have good values. Um, and it's just a good read overall. It's a good read. It's a kind of a feel good because this, you watch this team go through all these trials and tribulations and how it's difficult and it's hard and it's not fun. It's very painful in some aspects um, because sometimes it requires you to get rid of negative people or toxic people in, in your life, which is what happens in the book. They end up, you know, doing, getting new getting new leadership. And because of that, it changes the entire flow of the book, which is something that anybody can relate to. We all go through, you know, changes in our own leadership and we see how the platoon can like grow or it can diminish and become less of what it was. So um, overall, I think it's a really good book. Um, I definitely recommend it for anybody who's looking for a good read or an inspirational read. Um, highly recommend it. So thanks.